What a beautiful warm weekend it's been. Let's send it over to meteor meteorologist Chelsea Ingram. Chelsea, I was out at the pool yesterday. It was beautiful to get outside today. What's the rest of the forecast looking like? Rachel, a perfect weekend to spend time outside. Oh my gosh, and what a great pool weekend for sure. Um, we've got some good weather heading our way to start out the week, but it will turn hot and humid very quickly. So let me get right to it. We'll start you out with a look at the stats from today. It certainly was a day atypical of this time in June. 76 degrees was our official high temperature. That's well below the average for this time of year. The average is right around 83. Where do we stand right now? Well, temperatures are in, believe it or not, the 60s and 70s. It is 74 right now in Bel Air, 74 in Baltimore. We have 68 in Westminster, and it's right now 69 degrees in Hagerstown. So we are setting up for a very comfortable night as temperatures drop into the 50s. Our winds are coming in with a bit of an easterly component. So when you bring in that Atlantic moisture, you typically are talking about more in the way of cloud cover. I anticipate that's what we'll be dealing with as we head into the overnight hours. That'll also be the situation as we make our way into tomorrow. I anticipate we'll see more in the way of cloud cover. Meanwhile, look for an overnight low temperature right around 58 degrees closer to the city and the suburbs. We're talking low and mid 50s, so it's a great night and a great opportunity to give your AC a break and perhaps even let in some fresh air because you are going to have to crank up the AC as we head into the end of the work week. We'll talk about that in the seven day forecast. Here's a look at satellite and radar. While it does look like there's a bit going on in the mid Atlantic, it's really that area of high pressure right now located over uh, Prince Edward Island in New Brunswick. That is influencing our weather in a really big way. It's going to bump all that shower activity to the south. Keep us dry as we start out the work week. Look how that area of rainfall sinks to the south. So we stay dry really through Tuesday and shower and storm chances don't really return until Wednesday and most of those are going to be for areas south of Baltimore. So southern Maryland and the lower eastern shore. However, it will get a little bit more active later this week. We're seasonably cool tomorrow with partial sunshine again with that easterly component to the wind expecting more in the way of cloud cover 78 degrees for the high temperature and for our Maryland longshoremen our crabbers and our recreational boaters tomorrow looks like a great day on the bay bay temperature right around 73 air temperature 78 with winds out of the east at about 5 to 10 knots here's your seven day forecast I told you things are going to be heating up you'll have to crank up the AC by the time we get toward the weekend look at this we're on our way into the upper 80s on Friday best chances for shower activity Thursday Friday a couple of showers Saturday and then Rachel as we head into Saturday and Sunday we are back into the 90s with humidity returning as well. We'll keep a track on the forecast though throughout the week. I'll send things back inside to you.